welcome back, guys. Uh, I think we need to clone this train. Uh, the train that is delivering bricks and tools to uh, Sacramento, San Antonio, and Sunnyvale. Uh, so it uh, should actually be Sac San uh, Sun, not Sub Sun. Uh, so yeah, I th really think we need to clone that because right now it only has a rate of 131 and we need more than that. We need a lot more than that. So let's see if we can clone you. We can. Beautiful. Uh, I did let the game run a little bit in between episodes, but not that long, maybe 20 minutes. And we actually paid off uh, half of our loan, so we have 15 million that we can spend. But I think getting an extra train on this is going to be really good for us. I think it's going to be really good for us. How many tools are you coming in with? 65. So... We should be delivering logs twice every time we pick up planks once. So this should... Oh, look at all those planks we have sitting there. Beautiful. We have a ship that is getting ready to go. We have 112 on board, but in are coming some more. So there, you're off. Uh, you picked up 138 bricks. Beautiful. And you got full. So this is really good. This is really, really good. So the next ship will be full and so will the next one. So this is awesome. And what does the rate say for these right now? 220, that's perfect. That's perfect. Because our tool thing is not quite there, but it should have a pretty high demand. So Sacramento, why is it Sacramento only 68? Sacramento... has a demand of 112. It might simply be that we need more trucks on here, and I think we do. Uh, let's just make sure that I haven't told this to pick up anything in particular. No. Ah, come on. There we go. Let's pin that. Uh, let's took a look at the rate. 83. We need more vehicles on this. Let's clone four. That is simply the problem. We need more vehicles on this. And we might need more vehicles down in... In Sunnyvale as well. Man, it's stuttery today. Not sure why. Uh, let's see, yeah, rate of 41. Let's clone, and let's just make sure that, yeah, you can pick up both, so that's fine. Alright, that's better. And up here... You're all sitting waiting. Uh, when is some more fuel gonna come in? We have fuel coming in here. Yep. Okay. Now. When coming down, 
I really should say, so in San Antonio South, when coming down, and you're going to Sacramento South, you should really be over on a terminal like five or six or four or something. Uh, oh, can't I do that? Do I have to turn all of these off first? And then I can... Why can't I... Oh, I have to do it in... Do I have to do it on the... Here? Yeah. Uh, so... Uh, let's lock you. Open that. So... The first stop is San Antonio South, then going to Sacramento South. Uh, so you really should be on Terminal 6. Oh. Terminal 6. And Terminal 3 when coming up. And going back down to Sunnyvale Fuel Depot. Yeah, that's fine. But I think this is better. And then over here we have one and four on the same one. Uh, I think I want um, so. Yeah. Why is it going to Sunnyvale North? That should just be Sunnyvale. Okay. Um, so you go to terminals two and three, I think. So one from San Antonio to Sacramento. That will be going down yep yeah. and then number four should be on two so like that I think is better I think that's better And in down here, this is not Sunnyvale North. This is Sunnyvale. Uh, is this no? That's Sunnyvale Annex. Oh, I see. The passenger and the cargo stations have different names now. I don't think they used to have that, did they? Sacramento, Sacramento. Weird. Okay. But look at the money coming in. So, yeah, we spent 12 million there. So, of course, we made a loss, but 3 million, 8 million. And this looks like a, one of the terrible months, maybe. Ah, we're only halfway through it for years. But did this, all this fiddling, do anything? Yeah, not a lot did it. Um, might actually need yet another train on here. Uh, there's one. The rate is 353 now. So it should be kind of okay. Should be kind of okay. I think it'll be fine. So you're going up right now. And there should be one down here. Uh, you're coming back up. I just delivered. We have 
quite a bit of stuff sitting here. But we also have quite a lot of trucks on their way down to get stuff. So that's fine. In Sacramento, okay, we solved the Sacramento problem. That's for sure. Everything is being delivered. Wow, look at that, all that money. We can repay all our debts. That is awesome. No more debts, guys. Oh, let's let the date continue on just a little bit. Now, I do wanna, because down here, I mean, you're f producing as fast as you can, and we have too many trucks. So, why is the rate. Oh, it's 400 now. Okay, so let's uh, sell you. Let's sell you. Let's sell you. And let's sell you. Okay, this should do it. The rate should still be 400. 312 it says. But there is a truck right behind waiting to pick up every time. So this is as much throughput as we can get on this line. This is absolutely as much throughput as we can get on this line. There's just no two ways about it. There is no two ways about it. This is as efficient and as this line can get. It just is. Four hundred. All right. That's fine. We have ships sitting here. Why is your rate only three ninety six? That bugs me. just doesn't get more efficient than this on the on the vehicles the trucks so I think sell you sell you I mean, they do fill up pretty quick. What does your rate say now? 364, I'm gonna pin that and I'm gonna say, uh, sell you. Three forty-eight. Let's hope that's not true. So, hopefully, this will be fine. Hopefully, this will be fine. We'll, we'll check it later. Uh, you're waiting for some logs. Where do we have logs coming down? Do we have logs coming down? You're picking up right now. You just picked up 216 logs. Good. <clears throat> You're going up with 65. How much is sitting here? 375. You're going the other way. 
Why are you not picking up full? Why are you not getting a full load? When there's are so many planks sitting here. Uh, that's a little annoying. I suppose I could tell them to wait for a full load here. Manage line in the first Murfreesboro stop. Uh, wait for a full load. That shouldn't be a problem. That shouldn't be a problem. Now I might be able to sell one more ship on this line. I don't like that the rate is 348. I really, really don't. And I don't understand why it's 348, because we have ships sitting here waiting. And our rate on our trucks, if I can click one, is 401. I mean, exactly what we need, basically. So why aren't these getting a full load every time? Immediately, basically. I hope they will. Oh, we just got another quarry here. <laughs> well, we don't need two quarries to feed one uh, construction uh, factory. So no need for that. Uh, how are we looking at this station? We still get a lot sitting here. You're a passenger train. Columbia coal mine was founded. Are you? Yeah. 35 and 16. And this is getting emptied, so that's fine. And Sacramento has quite a bit sitting here, but the truck should be able to handle it. And Sacramento is getting, not getting, not of, uh, thanks autosave. It's not getting a lot of tools, but it is getting some tools. Is getting some tools. Uh, do we have a ship on the way up? This is probably the one before I set them to wait. Come on, ship! Yeah, I think so. Uh, you, 130, 130, good. And we still have 292 sitting here. And you have a lot of logs sitting here, so this should help. This should help. Here comes another load of logs. Do we put another train on this? Do we put another train on this? I think maybe we do. I'm not entirely sure, though. Uh, so your rate is 191. You can do 400. Of 
course you can do 400 too, and, but we do need 800 here. Eventually. Because right now we don't have the demand for it. We have 121, uh, 151, 159. New plane. Uh, 219. So we don't really need a higher rate on that. Uh, what's the rate on the ships? 192. I think I think I'm gonna clone one ship now. Though they are sitting waiting down here, this is kind of the bottleneck. This is kind of the bottleneck. Let's have a look at our lines before we decide anything. So the bricks is doing uh, the ship. Brick ships are doing okay. Tools to Providence is doing okay. Bricks to uh, Fargo and Scottsdale is doing great. Um, tools to Providence, fuel to San Antonio. Uh, where are our new ships? Where are our new ships? Oh, they're there. They're turning a profit. Kinda. But they will most definitely turn a much higher profit now that they will be full of planks leaving from here. So that's great. How many tools do we have waiting? 102. No, I should actually tell this line to uh, in Fort Collins port. Uh, wait for a full load. Forever. 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 Okay. Because why not? Why do you have so much many? Oh, you don't have uh, many stored. That's kind of the problem. So, so many. 130, go. 130 planks, oh, only 65 planks for you. Yeah, so you won't ever get full. So I think as soon as... Just turn around. Now, the next ones that get up here, these two, they'll be able to do the full load thing. And that'll be fine. Okay. Now, who, which towns are our biggest nowadays? Let's see. San Antonio is the biggest. Providence, the second biggest. Vancouver, the third big, biggest. That surprises me with the old Baldwin six-wheelers six supplying them. Uh, Sacramento, Fort Lauderdale, Provo, Grand Prairie, Jackson. Okay. Detroit is way down here. But it only has uh, uh, public transport uh, increasing its size. The others all have, uh, all of these have products being delivered. So yeah. Um, yeah, so that's why, isn't it? Uh, Cleveland Farm. Okay. We have a lot sitting there. 
going the one way, not a whole lot going the other. And here comes a train going the way that doesn't really need a lot of stuff right now, or doesn't have a lot of stuff waiting right now. So that kind of sucks. That kind of sucks. This road is getting pretty busy. That road is getting pretty busy. Hmm. Wow, look at that. We have 27 million in the bank. Wow, 14 million we made that year. That is awesome. Oh, look. Our road vehicles are actually turning a profit. That's the first time I've seen that. Our road vehicles are actually turning a profit. They were in the negative for a long, long time. That is great. That is just great. Okay, what do we have sitting here? We have some tools sitting there. You are full of fuel. So when is the fuel chain coming in there? With 152 fuel. Okay. This is good. Tools is not getting giving a boost yet. Which is a little annoying. But it should be growing. At some point, I want to change this station so that it's in the middle of town. Like right here. It annoys me that there's nothing on one side of it. I could encourage it to build out that way, but I don't really think... I'd rather have it be a coastal town. And once we move this train station in here, it won't mind growing either way. Yeah. Okay. So we haven't done a whole lot in this episode, but... We have optimized, we have been making things a little bit better all around. We're making more money, which is great. We still have a lot of ships sitting waiting here. But hopefully when we start having ships kind of waiting here as well to be get full, That'll change. So you're coming up with 130. You're coming down with 130. Yeah, this is good. This is good. And uh, this line in San Antonio port can only pick up bricks, yeah. Okay, I am considering doubling up the train on this line here, but making some of it um, what are they called? Uh, boxcars. You know what? I think I'll do that. Where's the train? There it is. Uh, so let's see. Let's keep you open there. 
and we'll edit this train and then we'll clone it. Okay. So I think we'll take four of these off. And then add one, two, three, four. Uh, modify. And then we will clone. And the train will be coming out there, going down. That's perfect. Then uh, up here, uh, well, this line, uh, managed line, we will tell it in San Antonio port. You can pick up tools as well. And that will get tools going down here to Fargo and Scottsdale. Oops, I didn't want to click on that. Uh, so Fargo wants 48, Scottsdale wants 75. That's pretty good. Um, and where do they want them? Tools up there, that's kind of perfect. And tools down here, that's not as perfect. But it's still going to cover a lot of them. Well, actually all of them for now. So that's good too. We definitely need more vehicles on this. Um, Uh, there, manage vehicles, clone, and clone, I think. So we get five vehicles on there. What about down here? This doesn't seem to need as much. Um, oh, is this, this is flat cars. So we need to replace those with the tarpaulins and then we can maybe get one more on because there will be coming tools now. And even though we took four cars off the one train. Uh, we should. Oh, uh, we need signals down here. Signals, one way, yes. Uh, there, 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 uh, there, there. Yeah. Okay. And this train no longer can wait for a foot full load at Scottsdale East. Uh, load if available. Should be available all the time anyway. Alright. So what's the rate on this line now? 404. That's kind of perfect. But of course, we need to consider that uh, some of it is, well, it's two different types of cargo, so, but look at the money, man. All right, we spent 14.2 million there, so we made 5 million effectively. 4 million, 7 million, this is going to be probably around, well, we'll see, I guess. 
Let, let's actually just pin this up here and see when it ticks over. Uh, and let's. So I'm just gonna make this a little bit narrower, like that, and then we can pull up our lines and see how they're doing. So. Cargo liver fuel, bricks and tools is not making money. Kinda expected that. Fuel to Port Lauderdale, it makes money most of the time. It makes money most of the time. Uh, so, it should be fine. I mean, we have a lot. <clears throat> we have about the same amount of lines that make money and lose money, but that's okay. I think next time, uh, what we'll do is work a little bit on New York. Uh, well, I think we'll update Vancouver because. <laughs> Uh, the poor wheels are falling off these trains so and I had did have a comment about that so I think we'll work on this make it a little bit uh, better maybe um, so extend the trains uh, extend the the, uh, the train stations stuff like that and then I think we'll also work on New York, get New York's train stations extended and upgrade the trains, stuff like that. So we made 4.7 million, 5 million, 5 million we made on that fiscal thingy. And water was actually the biggest moneymaker. And so was it there and there. So yeah, our waterways are doing nicely. Wow, there are two fuel refineries here. That seems redundant. That seems redundant. Uh, what do we have going here? <laughs> uh, old horse-drawn carriages. Um, yeah. We, we need to, to fix all of this up. And we will do that. We will do that. Yeah, that's the plan. That is the plan. But it's looking good. Our lines are making money. Uh, the, uh, this line isn't making money right now, but it should definitely make money in the long run. It should definitely make money in the long run. Uh, Let's move you on to Terminal 2, because why do you have tools on board? Seriously, why do you have tools on board? Just go. Uh, is it because I haven't told you up in Fort Collins port. You can load tools and unload planks. In San Antonio port, you have to unload tools. You have to. There's just no two ways about it. Can I force it uh, to unload everything? No. So that's a problem. Now down in Tallahassee port, you can load that, you can't unload anything. So why are you bringing tools down? I don't get that. Why are you bringing tools down? You don't, you're not allowed to unload them anywhere except San Antonio. So why did you bring tools 
along from San Antonio. That is something I don't understand. Are you the same? No, good. Are you the dummy? No. Are you the dummy? No. You're not the dummy. You're the dummy. You know what? I'm gonna sell that ship. I'm gonna sell that ship and hope that we have no more dummies. It might just have been a fluke of timing. It might just have been a fluke of timing. I hope it is. But what's our rate here now? 187. But they're waiting for stuff all the time. They are constantly waiting for stuff. Which is annoying. Well, you got full now, and the next ship will be full. Here's the next delivery, it's there. Wouldn't mind these trains to be a little bit further away from each other. I really wouldn't. Hmm. is waiting there 74 so you're not getting a full load and the other train is only there you know what let's just stop you for a second and wait until that train gets a little bit further ahead like up here at least Really, it should go down and turn around before I start it again. Go, go. Well, some bricks got loaded off, so that's good. Uh, these need to be changed as well, I just noticed. Let's just let it pull in here and then we can unstop this. Just to get a little bit more of a steady flow, you might say. Okay. Load up and turn around. There we go. And go okay uh, let's see here you uh, manage line no not manage the line manage the vehicles want to click it uh, click it click it all right manage vehicle replace you with the tarpaulins So that we can carry tools as well. I think this is better. They're better spread now. And I think that's a good thing. 
No, up here. You're waiting. Ooh, new trucks, new train. Okay. And there should be enough that you get a full load, right? Yeah, there should be. Right? No? No. When's the next ship coming down with some logs? It's far, far away. All right. Mm. Well, right now we don't have a ships waiting down here. Now the ships are waiting up here. I really do want them to have a full load here, though. Where the hell is a ship coming down with logs? Uh, you will be the next one. And... <laughs> Alright, uh, we have a kink. So, in... Let's say Tallahassee port. Uh, Fort Collins port. Uh, don't wait for a full load. Load if available. Um, Murfreesboro port. I do want you to wait, but not right now. So load if available. And then in Tallahassee port, we want to have a full load. Okay. Oh, that was annoying. That was annoying. That has dropped everything down. That sucks. But we are way out of time. So we're going to have to continue on in the next one. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.